guys we're back for another video and today is that a day again um that we had a little bit before on algebra and that day is here again we are actually starting unit three of algebra i'm so excited um because we worked so hard i'm gonna be super honest we've worked really hard building up these skills with cube roots um and the square roots and equations and all this really cool momentic stuff and now we're gonna apply all of this information again to our next unit um but now this is gonna be a little different so how we applied the equations stuff to our um to our cube root and square root um things we're not gonna apply all that to our next unit which is gonna be over scientific notation this unit is going to be very short. I will be super honest with you. There's not a lot of things to go really into scientific notation. Um, we're going to learn just one or two exponent rules in this um, thing. That's what's making sure there's a lot of exponent rules. There's like five or six um, that are good ones. But we're, um, for this unit, we're only going to do one or two. Um, as continuously, I love making videos, I just don't have the time to upload things, and, um, Algebra, the two videos of Algebra are out, and they're done. Ancient China's been there for a while, hasn't came out, but it's gonna be Ancient China, it's gonna be Indus Civilization, and it's gonna be, um, Ancient India, so it's a little, that's the order, hopefully that stuff will come out. Um... Yeah, so that's pretty much it, but we're going to work on a unit 2, and you guys know, uh, we're going to deck up unit 2 really nicely. We're going to probably just kind of decorate, have a little fun, or we're going to just do some key vocabs as well. Um, I don't know. Let's go ahead and do it. So, if I can, sorry, <laughs> I'm trying to type something. Okay, so, um, okay, we haven't really made a unit three page, which is kind of, or a unit two, like, kind of page, so we're not going to do that, but, um, key vocab, so let's just do that for today, so I'm going to put key terms, okay, that's too big, <laughs> key terms, okay, so the first one is going to be an obvious, which is scientific notation. Uh, did I spell that right? S C I E N T I F C or T. Uh, yeah, it's great. I think I'm not sure. Okay, so we have our basic scientific notation. I'm going to do this, this little light green, <laughs> and this uh, means uh, a mathematical, let's say math, medical, medical expression. A mathematical expression used used to represent <laughs> oh god I spelled that wrong there's no R why did I even put that oh okay. represent I don't know why It's like, sorry, I'm, I'm messing it. Represent. There we go. There's a little R. I don't know why. All right, just let's do it. And decimal number. Uh, and it has to be, okay, this is the key. Um, a decimal number. Oh, God. Uh-oh. My bad. I'm making so many mistakes today. <laughs> a represent. Uh, okay. A. Represented a decimal. Please say I don't make any mistakes. I'm sorry. I don't like putting a lot of vocab words. That's why I write them. Number. Between. 
1 in 10. Okay. And then multiplied by 10. So, like times by 10. So, we're just going to write that much again. And I'm going to highlight it. Now, we don't have a lot of keywords um, that I'm adding on this. So, we're doing scientific notation. And then there's... For scientific notation, there is... There's an, another obvious one, which is exponents, like, yeah, so. And that is basically, uh, so I'm going to put a quantity, yeah, let me just use the word quantity, Representing the power. Repre the power. Okay. The power of a number. Of a number. Okay. That's how much it is in this unit. Literally, that's all that's really key key official in this unit so we don't have a lot of keywords um popping up so much um and so it's just pretty much pretty basic pretty simple pretty uh self kind of defined so hopefully it's not a big hard thing also i'm going to kind of do the same thing um, but I've decided to use a little more, like, less thick, like, um, pen, so maybe that looks better, I don't know, but I decided to do that just to make it look a little more writing. Also, I've been getting a lot of questions on, do I use something to write with besides my hand, and if I'm using a stylus, what stylus is it? Because it looks like, it looks really, um, simple to use, and yes, I am using a stylus, and it's from this company called Elku, Elku or Elzo, I don't know. Um, but it's a really good company with very flexible and very, like, um, sensitive um, things, or sensitive stylus. And it can write really good. It's a good drawer um, for people who don't have iPad Pro. Like, I have the iPad Air 2 that I use to record videos on this. Now, personally, I like to just have a video recorder on one iPad and then other things on another one. So... But the iPad Air 2 is what I use to record, and so I don't, I can't use an Apple Pencil on this, unfortunately. I wish I, I probably would start to record on iPad Pro, I don't know. <laughs> but, um, that would be interesting if I do. Um, but yeah, so I do use a sensitivity one. Yeah. I, I was going to put game, I don't know why. Game, woo. Um, but yeah, so that's what I use, and I use the, like, clear one instead of the stylus version. I, I think it's much more sensitive, because here, I'll show you guys. Um, this is, like, the one with the stylus version. This is the, I, you probably can't tell the difference, but it's, like, when you actually are looking at it. Okay. Okay. Um, so that's their key terms. I'm not exactly sure what's our first unit going to be, um, base planting off of, like, if it's going to be simple, if it's going to be really, um, I don't know. <laughs> but, you know, you always have that baseline that you have to start off with, so that's kind of what I'm looking at. Um, and so, good come and... I'm pretty liking our section, like, there's little notes, and then we do at least four problems per lesson, and a good video, hopefully, preventing, um, um, things, so, <laughs> yeah, we just have to, the, the time I'm recording this video, episode 9 hasn't aired yet, um, so, like, I'm recording this, I'll tell you the date, because, um, uh, I'm like that, I'm recording this November 8th, um, and I don't know when it's gonna get posted, it might get posted, Somewhere around November 14th or 20 or 26th. Or maybe just 
like 10, 12. I don't know. I don't have things planned when I want to record, when I want to put um, stuff on YouTube. But I do record prehand. Um, we're going to answer quickly a little bit of questions I've been getting recently from some social media platforms. And I just want to get everything clear and rub with you. So. Um, everyone's been checking my description or something, and they're saying that you used to use the app called Fonto, and now you're using this website called Canva. Can you please make a video about how you make your thumbnails now? BTW, like your thumbnails. Thank you. Thank you so much for liking my thumbnails, and yes, I will do a video. Uh... Oh, this one was before. Yes, someone actually tweeted, can you update his software? And so I did get a new software that time. So I did one for Final Cut Pro. Um, anything else quickly that I can look through? Yes, journey with me. Hashtag season two. So this was our first applied hashtag season two that people think. And they're saying hashtag season two. Okay, so I think hashtag season two means the one of, or the two following. Okay. First meaning is that journey with me is going to soon or later have a hashtag to after or have a season two after um some more episodes come out and then they're saying or there is a course that is based off of called hashtag season two or season two <laughs> um basically it is a reality show <laughs> reality show Okay, let me just tell you one thing. No, it's not a reality show, but um, it's also not with the journey with me season two, so it's not that because we still have to get some episodes before we have a season two in journey with me. Um, but just think of hashtag season two. So here's another clue. Um, Shadow Wall season two. Okay. Topic Tuesday season two that never aired, but it came. It's on Topic Tuesday. It's not Shadow Wall season, but I'm trying to make up a little bit of puzzle pieces together to show you guys what it is actually. Um, but yeah, so there's the FAQs, and I will be making a updated Q and A video soon because a lot of things have been changing. So we just kind of gonna have to get raw a little bit and get real. So. Also, yes, I got new channel art. Oh, I think this is really good. I love the channel art. I think it definitely fits the winter and the season. Um, and it definitely just is me because I like a lot of cursive lettering and a lot of different colors and a lot of blue. Personally, my favorite color is orange, fun fact, but blue is my second primal, primal favorite color. But anyways, yeah, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.